the closest of friends and teammates as they entered their 20s. Kevin Garnett and Stefan Marbury approached their basketball middle age with little good to say about one another. The latest sniping occurred last month, when Marbury said his son's teammate, rookie Amari Stoudemire, was much better than Garnett at a similar age. Garnett responded that Marbury obsesses about him, quote, like a girl. It ain't as complex as it seems. You know, I know, I know we've been yapping in the, in the papers and in the public and in the media, but you know, him, him and I, we have a, we have a, uh, we have a history. And that's something that you can't ever take, you know, whether we decide to build off that or just totally, you know, let it evaporate, and that's on us. The split began in 1999. Marbury insisted on a trade for Minnesota to be closer to his friends and family in New York. Thinking they wouldn't be able to re-sign him, the Wolves traded Marbury to New Jersey, where he got paid and ultimately got traded again to Phoenix. My analogy for Kevin Stefan situation is Batman and Robin. They're a duo, but nobody says, I'll be Robin. Everybody wants to be Batman. Kevin was Batman, okay? Marbury didn't want to be Robin. He wanted to go be Batman on another team. And you know, you sort of hear, you know, from people from his camp and little things in between that to like, you know, he couldn't come play with you. Was, you know, the jealousy part or whatever. But until I, you know, until Steph says that to me, I'm going off of, of all history. Marbury declined to speak about his time in Minnesota or his current relationship with Garnett. But Garnett acknowledges that the two rarely communicate with one another these days. It's almost like something that's broke. You know, when you get a hole in your windshield, if you don't fix it, it just gets bigger and bigger. And before you know it, your whole windshield is shattered. When's the last time you talked to him? Last time I talked to Steph. Wow, it's been a minute. It's been a minute. It's been a while. Last time I had some, like, real numbers on him, it's been a while. They'll get a chance to start talking this weekend in Atlanta. For the first time since the trade, Marbury and Garnett will be teammates on the Western Conference All-Star team. After a while, man, see, this is what I played in my head, that if something was to happen to him, how'd I react? And I know I'd be hurt. You know what I mean? And that's, and that's true love. That's why I'm glad that, you know, this weekend's coming up, you know? Just from that standpoint alone.